What is happening, guys? Cowboy here, and we're back. Ready for round two against the Raveni. So I'm thinking if... Well, basically, I want to leave a couple people alive to rescue instead of being concerned with getting all 15 right at the start, because that kind of screwed me over last time. And I'm also going to go and basically cut that this thing's legs Nero. off this is right at the start. If you're King Moltnamoth. No, that's too soon. I dispatched a garrison to the city, but they won't arrive in time. If you boy. are as skilled as I have heard, Evil, then please save as many of my people as you can. So get us some energy to get the nice ball rolling. Job, Keep up the good work. If too much of the town is... I'll have to charge up my rune energy to take this thing down. Nice work! Keep going! Head of Raveni. There's no like really easy way to get back to this thing's neck. It's just, like running up the back makes the most sense, but it's like it doesn't want to. Now, Avil, execute the Raveni. Got him. I need my rune energy fully charged to execute this Raveni. Your work here isn't done yet. That Raveni you just executed wasn't the only one on its way to Moltnama. When you execute a Raveni, you will... It looks like this Raveni brought along a friend. You'll have to face them both. I need my rune energy fully charged to execute this Raveni. That's well, a good thing we're going to be charging it by cutting off this stupid thing's legs. Strike targets will glow when you aim at them. Give me the energy I need, and got him. You must not let the Raveni destroy the city of Eel. You are its people's only hope. I need my 
green energy fully charged to execute this Reveni. Great job. Keep it up. Avil, valid rune strike targets will glow when you aim at them. or its people killed, we will have failed. Hold your rune strike to execute the Raveni. Bye. I win. Hell of a difference from the last time we tackled this place. Thank you. Many of my people owe you their lives. Shit, did I get the 15? I don't know if I did. I agree. Your ally, Zandra. She creates your weapons. The Raveni use a rare mineral to travel between worlds. Zandra was able to fabricate this talking stone and our own portals from similar materials. I have at my disposal some of the most gifted alchemists, and even they do not understand the properties of this talking stone. Zandra is brilliant in many ways, yet as skilled as we are, she and I will not be enough to win this war. Will you combine your forces with our own to defeat this enemy, your highness? Initially, I was reluctant to believe your claims. I had always thought the Sentinels to be a myth, a story to put children to bed. And now? I believe. I don't know if I rescued enough people there. I got so distracted with killing the Ravennies. Oh, I did. Nice. Alright, and then... Oh, no! I'm 25 short of getting expert combat. Oh, well. Rune slowdown. Rune gravity. G-overflow. A lot of rune stuff coming in. On to chapter two. Well, I'd rather save chapter two for later time. The trials can you master them all? Instead of jumping into that, I want to try some of the other game modes this episode. Just because it seems kind of like there's not much to this game. Like, I mean, it's fun enough, but oh, come on, really? It's, uh, I don't know. I don't know if there's enough here to justify a $60 price tag. Like, it's not bad, but still, 60 bucks. Like, I don't know. Maybe, maybe the combat gets a lot more in-depth once I get upgrades. But right now, I would put this at, like, 30 
Oh wow, that actually hit. Killed a Ravani. Like, I don't like how I gotta keep charging this up. Like, this guy's kind of a basic bitch, Reveni. Let me just, you know, let me just kill him. Oh, we're dead. They freshly regrown hand. I get does any of that go towards my upgrade points no it doesn't look like it does that's a little it's a bit disappointing um, about skirmish test your skill in random battleground share your seed number with friends and compete for a high score so it's just randomly generated instances Back to watchtowers for nine minutes. Whoo! Long time. Like, I don't like that I have to, I don't know, maybe it's because I'm, I'm, you know, this is, in a sense, very similar to Attack on Titan, the concept of, like, you know, fight the bigger thing. Dismantle the bigger thing. Like, I mean, when you're fighting, uh, 
you know, big titans. I, you usually gotta take out the arms, take out the legs, get them on the ground, and then you can go for the nape. This feels very similar to that. Except I just cut off that thing's arm and then it just one shot me anyway. Like, I don't like how I have to build this bar all the way up. Because this isn't even like one of the big beefy armored ones, you know? This is like one of the, uh, this is like a basic Ravini. And this thing with the instant regen on its arms, that's a bit fucking much. Don't you think, dude? Don't you think it's a bit much that you can instantly regenerate your dumb arms? I don't think you're supposed to do these without a bunch of your upgrades, because I have like things that'll like let me do attacks out of dodges and whatnot, and I don't have any of that stuff. Damn, and that thing hits like a fucking Mack truck. It just looks like a little ogre. Why is this small ogre so potent? have ones like this thing where it's like a it's like a trial to get this thing exposed so that you can kill it Jesus Yo, beefy boy over here. Damn. I mean, based on this, it looks like we're gonna see some some decent enemy uh, variety. But even then, it's just different versions of the uh, love trigger to hit it. Over and over and over and over. Skull things. I'm guessing it's maybe because I haven't encountered these yet, but these seem outright immune to, to everything. I'm using Rune Strike and it's doing fucking nothing to these skulls. Well, either way, we're going to ramp this up for here. Uh, we will get started in Chapter 2 tomorrow. <clears throat> Jump in a little bit more. See if uh, the combat doesn't get a little bit deeper. Hopefully, once we grab a couple more of the upgrades, the attack off a of dodge and stuff like that, we'll uh, start to see the game evolve past the just you know, mash X and hold L2 to execute stuff. So anyway, make sure to stay tuned and we'll catch you guys tomorrow as we kick off chapter two.